This video on Alphabet is the second in a series on the Magnificent Seven, the megacap tech giants that are at the forefront of the artificial intelligence revolution. They are Alphabet, Amazon, Apple, Meta, Microsoft, Nvidia, and Tesla. The purpose of this series is not to attempt to determine if these companies are good or bad investments, but instead to explain the part they're playing in driving the artificial intelligence revolution forward. The goal here is to give MacroWatch subscribers a basic understanding of the rapid transformation of our economy that these companies and AI are bringing about. Here's a quote that conveys how quickly this revolution is accelerating. Mustafa Suleiman, co-founder of the Alphabet subsidiary DeepMind, recently told the Financial Times, the exponential trajectory of AI meant that two years from now, the large language models at the center of current AI development would be 100 times more powerful than OpenAI's GPT-4. 100 times more powerful two years from now. The ability of GPT-4 is already astonishing. It's difficult to imagine what 100 times more powerful could look like. And what about five years from now and 10 years from now? This AI revolution appears certain to transform the way our economy works at the macroeconomic level. We can learn about how this revolution is recreating our economy by studying the companies that are driving it. The previous MacroWatch video focused on NVIDIA, which designs the processors that AI runs on. Today, we'll look at Alphabet, the parent company of Google. Alphabet has long been considered to be the company with the most advanced AI research, although OpenAI's launch of ChatGPT last year has called into question Alphabet's leadership. Soon after becoming CEO of Alphabet in 2016, Sundar Pichai began referring to Alphabet as an AI-first company. And it's true that Alphabet's AI accomplishments have been extraordinary. They include developing TPUs, TensorFlow, the all-important transformer, and several generations of path-breaking foundation models.